Hey guys, welcome back to video number two with Hindi Action Hero. Um, today is December 11th. Uh, this is about two months, almost two months since I recorded the first video. Um, I still don't know if that first video is going to end up staying up on uh, YouTube. If you have had the chance to see it, um, good for you. <laughs> Thank you for sticking through it. It's about 38 minutes long. Uh, through that video, because you know I'm I'm learning as I go about this whole um, video making and everything like vlogging and stuff. Um, I found out that I cannot upload videos onto my blog, uh, the site itself. Um, I think there's like a cap for any type of video or anything that I put into the blog it's like 10 uh, megabytes and that's like nothing in terms of a video maybe a gif um, <laughs> so I have to upload what I'll do is I'll upload onto YouTube because um, right now that's the main video streaming or archiving thing that's available uh, for me so that was my backup plan anyway I'll stick to that I'll upload the videos there put the hyperlinks in my blog um, but w what I might do is I might still try to write blog posts um, just because the whole video process does take some time and uh, I'd, I'd like to also just try and upkeep my um, writing um, I did end up <laughs> uh, finishing a post that I had started like in 20, uh, 2018, early 2018. Um, I, I finished that up, added some things, uh, not really a very thorough update, but at least that post was then uh, uploaded onto the blog itself. Um, <laughs> it took me to upload that first video right from October 15th I ended up uploading it on October 19th I think uh, it took me about six attempts so the video file size was about 12 gigs um, that, that was it's too big so I realized what I'll do from now on um, I'll have my videos maybe between 10 12 ideally 12 minutes I don't want it to hit 15 so I'm gonna keep an eye on the time hopefully for this one um, what I might end up doing then is just putting videos like in segments um, so with this one uh, basically I kind of wanted to give a little update on what's been happening it's uh, why I haven't been recording as much um, for one, I am in school again, so I'm a little bit busy with that. I had, even at that time of the first video, I had resigned from my job um, just because it was hard to do with uh, my school schedule. Hopefully in the new year, starting from January, I'll be able to find some kind of like a casual position um, just because I do have still like two and a half years more for this degree so I don't want to kind of get swamped down again with work but because of that hopefully I'll be able to upload videos uh, more frequently so why has it taken so long it's mainly because of the weather so here in Canada it's winter um, and a lot of the days there's so much cloud cover right so the way my room is uh, the one window I have is right there uh, the Sun rises from that side and it sets uh, on this side so uh, usually like other than winter during the year maybe around 4:30 or 5 beautiful amount of sunlight comes through my window and then I thought you know what that would be perfect for uh, recording because it's natural light um, and I, I I just find it 
like it it works but <laughs> all, all this time the days when i was free at home uh, and then i thought oh maybe i should record a video or something there was so much cloud cover there was uh, like we had ice storms um maybe i might try and include a clip of that or some photos uh but otherwise it's so gloomy these days like it's it's so dark and then uh, the sun sets by about 3 30 like um for most of the winter so today like right now it's almost one um it's, it's not that bright but it, at the same time this is much brighter than it usually is so i thought you know what let me try and just bang out a couple videos, uh, see if I can, uh, and then also start doing all of those unboxings um, because honestly, there's so much stuff that I've left unopened, um, thinking that I'll make videos just um, to have for my blog, um, <laughs> and then everything it just keeps it's like a it's a positive feedback thing like it just keeps piling up right so uh yesterday because i've hit the end of my first semester in school uh i had my first exam yesterday my next exam is on the 14th so that's saturday so these videos even if i'm recording it now i highly doubt that they'll get uploaded until after the 20th of December so it's not it's not too far but I thought you know what let me at least try and record something um, in the meantime because if anyone knows me like I'm not I'm not a very studious person but I I prefer to cram so with my next exam being on the 14th I might end up uh, hopefully I'll start by tomorrow cramming uh, a semester's worth of information but <laughs> um, what I have uh, I wanted to do some unboxing stuff so this one I ordered from Amazon I'll tell you a little bit about it uh, it's a it's a Boku no Hero My Hero Academia Funko Pop um, but the main reason I got it from Sorry, I keep looking just to make sure that I'm not passing like 12, 15 minutes. Uh, main reason I got that is because, well, this one is an exclusive, right? So it's not in like my usual stores like EB Games and stuff. A lot of my pops I've ended up buying from EB Games. In terms of my city, that's the main um, store that would have Funko Pops at a decent price um, and a good variety of them. Uh, they've started stocking them in other stores as well, but uh, if I had to go, it, it's easy to go to EB Games. Uh, there, There is an online uh, store that I had started buying like in 2017, back when I first started getting into Funko Pops. They had really good deals that was kind of when they were also still new to the uh pop like franchise i guess um they were selling them for like uh nine dollars a pop and like uh, those were the discounts that they were offering right now if you go to buy them they're like on average about fifteen dollars a pop so it's like it's increased and even the site itself like they've increased it's still a really good site because sorry um, they have a really good variety of pops that sometimes are sold out in the retail stores and um, they have their own exclusives as well it's called pop in a box and I use the Canadian one so it's pop in a box dot ca um, I get nothing from them by mentioning them but I have bought from them so it's it's nice so even like this one this is my most recent order I had thought that I would not be ordering a lot of pops uh, because 
sorry, my computer went out. Oh, so that's 10 minutes. So maybe what I'll do is, now that I've hit 10 minutes, and you've seen that I am going to be unboxing videos, like unboxing pops in the next few videos. Um, what I might do is I'll probably wrap up this one uh, and then we'll continue on. Uh, I'll, I'm just going to give you a little bit of background about like how I had been buying pops and then also uh, why I ended up buying <laughs> a couple more. Um, and then maybe also open them up and see what came because I'm also excited. <laughs> I get these things and I leave them unopened and then I, like it's delaying gratification but then like I, I have to I have to open them at some point you know so I might as well do these these videos and get them get them done. Okay so I'll be back continuing next video.